arrived at White Hart Lane on Thursday, only hours after playing for Argentina in a World Cup warm-up game in Norway. He'd hardly slept, but was determined to turn out for Ozzy Ardiles, his friend and former international colleague, and for the first time to represent an English club, Spurs against Inter Milan. His presence certainly was an attraction for a marvellous crowd of 30,000. The Tottenham players were thrilled to have Maradona alongside them. Glenn Hoddle even gave up his number 10 shirt. And Maradona and Hoddle were to strike up an instinctive partnership. The two Argentinians made their own entrance along with Aussie's two sons. A night when there was magic in the air. Come on, you you've had from the English people here. Will there be any problems at all? Si Argentina, si Inglaterra tiene que jugar con Argentina en la Copa del Mundo, eh, pensando en la recepción que tuviste hoy esta noche acá, eh, ¿habría algún problema? Mm, no, no creo que, que no tendría ninguna clase de problema. O sea, um, ¿sobre qué, en qué sentido lo, lo pregunta? No sé, ¿no? Um, no, he said, uh, no, 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 no problem at all. Okay. And can I ask Diego uh, how much he enjoyed playing in front of an English crowd tonight? Yo decía que me sentía como en casa porque porque la gente entendió de que de que yo era uno más y que estaba que estaba queriendo ganar el partido con con los que juegan todos los domingos para ellos. ¿no? Sí, uh, he feel uh, he feel like, like playing at home, and uh, he's very happy that the uh, the crowd understand that the, his only worry was to try to win the game and fight very hard to win the game, and he enjoyed very much. <laughs> 